Greetings and welcome back guys to fact to Research Factorio and as you can remember last time we were going to continue working on getting towards our extending this and making some gears and I remember we were going for a certain research we were going for this so we want this research first which requires steel so we're going to do steel first that way we can start doing steel right away so we're going to extend this here and then start making some iron gear wheels and we need some smelter but we kind of want to wait a little bit just because we're going to get the electric furnaces pretty quick so I don't want to extend it too much in terms of making it built in but I think what we can do is we can make a whole bunch of red science packs just for the time being actually we'll make more labs because we're going to need them when we go and research them. So we'll just make them in advance just now. And we're out of science packs. I had a feeling that was going to happen. Okay, so we're out of science packs. So we got to cancel these labs here. And we'll get going on more science packs. There we go. So I guess we should kind of start... Actually, let's start clearing some of these trees. That would be beneficial. While we get some steel processing going. Here we go. And let's do this in the most efficient way that we can think of. So I'm going to try and put spaces between everything. So I'm going to keep this main area here as just like the main smelting line, just all the way in through here, smelting everything. And iron ore on this side, copper on that side. And if you I'm pretty sure I've said that before, but just in case you forgot, that's what our main goal is to keep. So I'll keep stuff that's made from iron as the main ingredient towards the bottom and copper towards the top. So obviously, iron gear wheels will be the first thing to be made, and then some copper wire will be the first thing to be made on the other side. And the only thing I'm just not sure of is where exactly we want to put that. I know the output for these is going to be it would be here but when we get the furnaces it'll be here so we need to save a spot so I'm just gonna put one there because I know it's gonna be there and I'll put this here temporarily so it's gonna come out this way because we're gonna make them go down but I think we'll make them go down and we'll come down out here or we could have just some inserters take them off the line right away uh, right right here and just put them downwards but that's fine we'll have them probably come down this way down over here and where do I want it to end because I don't know how big I want to make this area in here that's the part that I'm not sure about but we'll go back down here we'll fill this up with the science packs that we have and 21 that should be enough to get steel finished. And while we're here, we'll put it down. Put two more in. There's another one. And there's one more being made. And golden. All right, cool. I guess we should start iron gear wheels and stuff right away. That way we can kind of get the gist, because we're going to need these inserters anyway. So let's just put this in here. We'll get it started. We'll kind of make a temporary one, and then we'll go from there until we get the electric furnaces. So same thing with up here, we'll make a temporary one, so skip one, and we'll start it here. We'll just make something really temporary, we're going to need more transport belts it seems. So we'll make a whole bunch more of those. We've got some inserters ready to make here, there. And then we'll also go for the power one next. That way we can get some bigger electric poles. So you want to keep... Okay, cool. So let's go for advanced material processing, which we need green. Oh. Hmm. Didn't think that through, to be honest. I, I think I saw green... And I just didn't think about it. That's kind of upsetting. Alright, so for the time being, we'll do electronics. What's it take to make green ones? We can make 75 of them. Oh, we just need an inserter and transport belt. Okay, so that won't be too hard. 
Uh, so see, there actually is no good way to... Alright, well, so we'll just leave a whole bunch of spaces. And let's just get this going. So we just need to leave a whole bunch of space. And then, what's actually being... I think I want... Uh, uh, where's the... here it is. Alright, so it's going to require... it requires electronics anyway to get the better poles and steel processing. Alright, so let's go down and change this out. We will do that, and we're going to start making some assembly areas, but we're going to need power here and there. Look at that, beautiful. Right in between these two. And we'll just keep that pattern for a while. Uh, let's just make it come down more. Down to here-ish. And down to here-ish, because we're going to probably expand as we need to. And then we'll add a little bit of a distance and then we'll come right there we need more transport belts here we go and we'll start about here as soon as we make some more we'll start about there so that's one two three four five so I just want to make this even so one two three four one two three four five this one should be going that way like that and that's pretty even okay and then we'll just start some temporary iron gear wheels being made down here so we'll make some assembly machines and we'll run this over here as we cut down these trees I totally forgot about the fact of making science pack twos for some of this stuff I don't know why I didn't think about that at first. I thought I was just going to be an easy, quick sprint to it. But I was incorrect. So we're just getting rid of all these trees so they're not in the way anymore. And then obviously we're leaving this much of a gap because eventually this... Actually, let's do three more. So one, two, three, four, five. That's better. So five more. One, two, three, four, five. Is that right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One more. One more. Ten. There we go. Grab all this. All right, now we have plenty of extra room for when we get more iron put in. Let's just run that across to there. And we'll run this across. No, what do you mean no? To there. Hey look, we need more transport belts. Shocker. Alright. I'm running out of iron. Which is fine. We can just go along here and collect some. So now, we're going to put the assembly machines, we're going to put them not up here, we're going to put them down here. So let's start right here, right there, and we'll put it just like that. Now we want to leave a gap of one, this tight or this tight, yeah, I'm actually not sure. I don't know if I want it this close together or this close together. I'm not entirely sure. Let's just go for a space. Just in case. And we'll do five. Put some inserters down here. Right in the center. And then these will make iron gear wheels. Oh man. And then just as oh we're gonna need more inserters. Let's make some of those or any more transport belts. And then just as a temporary thing we'll have them in some boxes, perhaps. But we do need to run some power over here.
Can I get all of them? No. Well, I do want all of them, so I'll just do that. And then I should be able to go... Alright, we'll stick it in between each of them. Just like that. And then we're going to need some more boxes. We'll make some iron chests, I think. We'll make five of those. Just that way we have something to store them in while we figure out where we want to run it to next. So we'll put one there, 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 and there. Because I know for the red science packs, they need iron gear wheels and copper plates. Because the copper plates could be split, and then we'll take some of the copper plates and run them to our science pack production, which we'll have to plan out. So now let's get some copper wire in here, since that's the next thing on our agenda. And we'll make it even like the other one. We'll make some iron chests while we're here, and cutting down some trees. That'll be fun. That might be enough. And then where'd we start the other one? Oh, I ran out of a tool, really? Alright, well, can't make a steel tool yet. Oh, I just made five. Well, whatever, we're going to need it anyway. So we put it right on the end. So one there. And this one went in the middle. So middle, space, middle, space, middle, space, middle. Oh, so close. Almost made it even. There we go. And we'll rotate these around. Just like that. And we're going to need more. Make some more inserters. Get rid of these trees. I know these are going to be in the way eventually. Trees help you in reducing pollution, but in order to make and build stuff, you got to get rid of them. I don't know. It's such a... I mean, the concept of it makes sense, but it's just kind of funny when you think about it. That you got to get rid of the trees, even though they're helping you reduce the most pollution. It's just kind of funny. And there, I've got to make some more. Make five. So this will be making copper wire. There it is. Never understood why it's in this area. I think it would make more sense to be in this area. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Alright, so let's not insert wire. We'll just put one right in the middle of each. And we'll get some iron chests. There we go. Now we got some copper cable. So now we can go along here and grab some of these iron gear wheels. And we can make a whole bunch of red science packs. Because we have a whole bunch of copper plates and stuff. Because I think our science pack ran out. See, so yeah, see, now this is getting real slow. So we definitely need more smelters along here. So we're going to bump up our stone furnace by double. And we'll get it set up early. So we'll kind of guesstimate where this needs to go. So one, one, two, three. So one, one, two, three, one. One, two, three, one. And we got to make some more. All right, well, let's just cancel the red science packs for now. And let's just get these going. And these need coal. So I forgot that we're going to need to go make a coal run here. More inserters. Let's just make a bunch. Let's go grab some coal that's down here, which should be a whole bunch in this chest. If not, we'll just run back and grab a whole bunch that's right here. That'll be fine. How much is in here? Oh yeah, 950. That's plenty. Plenty, plenty. And I'm going to actually get rid of that one and that one. And you know what? Let's do this. Let's actually change this. Because... I know I'm going to have them do this way, because if we keep having them make iron gear wheels, it's just going to be kind of pointless. So same thing with the copper plates. I mean, it's nice to have a, the temporary buffer that I can have now that I have some of my inventory. 
but eventually we're going to burn through too much of this just making those basic materials. We might as well just stop and uh, we'll leave these here for now. We'll wait till we actually get up the whole processing line in order to really spruce it up, but at least we have some set up. So we can take some of the science packs down. That we need to definitely work on. So let's actually make some of the red science pack stuff. We'll cancel those. So where do we want to put some of the red science pack? Let's make five. We'll make some more labs too. So where do we want to put that? That's the question. Because we want to kind of keep our area where we research centralized. So I'm thinking if we run... Oh man, this is complicated. <laughs> I never remember where I really want to have things nice. Because they do use both of these. Let's maybe run them over here. No, because then we'd have to run other stuff all the way over there to make the red science packs. So let's... I don't know yet. I don't know. Let's focus. Let's make... Let's make some... Let's make some of the electronic circuits. That would be my next one. So where do I want electronic circuits to be made? That's my next problem. So electronic circuits use both the copper cable and the iron plate. And they use more of these, so I want these to be closer than the iron. So this is where our main area is. So we'll make a splitter and split this off. Actually, stick some of these up in here. So let's stick a splitter right in there. And then this can come down and turn around and then we'll make it go underground after we make some more belts because it's got to go underground under here make some more belts and we're out of iron plates which is okay we can come back see this is what I mean we're already kind of out so I guess we should start up doing we should start up doing these smelters in here. That probably would be smarter so we have more resources. So let's get it set up first. So let's get that there. We're just going to do iron ore for now. And we'll put 50, 50, 50, 50, and 50. And we got to get some power over here. Oh, and we have to also put some inserters in here. Just like that. Then we'll put power. I keep forgetting to put power. There we go. We can do... Oh, no, I guess we can't. We have to do one every other. Now we'll put this in here. Here we go. Now we should start outputting a whole bunch more. There we go. All right, so these will come up. Run up here. And they'll go underground. as far as it can go and then they'll run let's just make more of these because we're going to need more do we want them to go let's keep them as out of the way as possible so let's do this that and then actually we don't want it to go too far because we might split our iron off, or our copper off. So we'll actually go... Oh no, but then we're going to get in the way of this expanding thing. Because we're definitely going to have a lot of electric furnaces. So this actually has to be planned a little bit better. Uh, I guess... Let's keep this going still. Because we're going to have to go under that anyway. And then we'll just keep we'll just make it go underground as much as we can from here to there. And then that'll be fine to 
expand off if we need it. There's plenty of room to expand off to the left or right, and we can move it down. But we do need more. I'll make two of these. All right, so these are going to come up, and they're going to circle around. So we'll make some more room for all of them. Just like that. Cutting down trees is the worst. And then we'll go down here, leave some room for expansion, just in case. And then we'll go up. Go up a little bit. And then we'll go over. And this will be where our circuits are. And we'll make some assembly machines while we're here which are uh, here which we have five so we're good we don't need to make any more oh I hate that I can't see there we go get rid of that there we go we have to get rid of these trees here we're gonna need some more power lines. I can see that. Actually, let me just make ten. All right, and then we gotta run this iron straight up. We'll do some more underground ones so they stay out of the way, just like that. And they can run above ground this way. Oh, it can run over here like this. Stupid trees. Go away. And then it can go straight still, come up. Then we're going to make it go underground again. Come back over. So we have room to split off the copper wire if we need to. And it'll come down and join up this. And that way it'll have one on one side and one on the other. And it'll be great. So perfect. Come on, get rid of the trees. Get rid of the pollution eating trees that we need, but yet they're in our way, so we cut them down. And we'll make five of electronic circuit assembly machines. And that'll be great. So we'll make one inserter here. We'll leave some room. One there. Space, 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 and space. Get rid of that tree. Bring this over. More inserters. We're going to need to make more. Get rid of more of the trees. Which is not a good thing, but that's okay. It's for the greater good, I promise. And we'll run this. No, we don't want to end there. We need more already? Man, we need so much stuff. One more. There we go. Some power lines in between these. And then the power lines can come down and over stupid tree. Move out of the way. Come down over there. And these can make electronic circuits. Oh man. Perfect. So that's there. So I guess we can do the same thing. So that electronic circuits are used in... I know they're used in the inserters so the iron gear wheels we'd have to shove up from here and make them come down here so I guess stuff that's made in productions of either of these two besides iron and copper we will put out in the middle here so that way they can just kind of run out and then up towards where they need to go that's what we'll do so 
anything that's like an intermediate thing. So like these science packs, since they use copper plates, we'll put them up here-ish somewhere. But where, I don't know. Or we should put them here. I don't know, it's kind of complicated. <laughs> I always hate planning things out because then I always want to move stuff later on. It sucks. Because <laughs> uh, we have to get Science Pack 1 going because we have like no research at all. And it's been a little while and we need to start getting research going. Uh. Where would be the best? Let's make five again first. And we need more electronic circuits. So we'll just go over here and we'll grab some. All right, can I make another one? Oh, I'm out of iron plates. That's fine. I can just grab a whole bunch from here. Ta-da, and you're out of coal, which is fine. We have plenty of that. There we go. Now we can make another one. Good. Ah, oh, where do we want science pack? Maybe we should just make it in the middle. And then science pack one is copper plate, iron gear wheel. So let's make it more down here. So we'll run them down here. So we'll run some copper plate. We'll take off one of the sides, which we need a splitter for. And we'll take it off right there. We'll make it curve. And then go down like this one. And then we'll run it underground to match this one here. So where... Oh, I need some more underground stuff. That's why. Make some more transport belts, because we're going to need them. So there we go. That's underground there. And then we're going to want to run it underground more. Because if we want to split off that iron again, we're going to want the room to do that. So we go there. And there. And then these iron gear wheels can expand that way. So they come down. And over like that. And we put another splitter, which went up here, like that. And we can run this one this way. And we'll run it out a little bit. This one will bring... It won't bring it anywhere yet. So this one we can run just, uh, we'll leave some more room, and then we'll bring it up here to there. No, I want to give it a little bit. So we want to run it to about here. So we'll actually change this just a tiny bit, and we'll run it down, over, up, and that way... This can follow down. We'd make more. Down. Like that. No, what are you doing? That's not what I wanted. There we go. Oh, that's perfect. Now we can start making some science packs. So we'll put one right there. One space. One space. One space. Almost dead on. Cool. And then there, there, and there. Make more of these because we're going to need them. And these are going to make science packs. Oh man. And then we'll put some inserters. Not there. Not, not there. Cool. Put them in the middle. Middle. And then we'll run it just right next door. Like that. And we got some science packs. And then we'll run this one down. Just like that. And we'll try and decide where we want them to go. 
So we have actually some science pack ones that were being made. And we've got some iron gear wheels. And we got some copper wire and some electronic circuits. It's going really well. And it looks like... Oh, okay, this iron's just not taking from here. We can actually get rid of that. Because that's not going to go that far. But now we have a whole line of these that we can come down. And right now I'll put them in a chest. Oh, of course you need power. Or, better yet, I will come down here. Oh, they still need power anyway. So that's fine. And we'll steal this lab we have over here. Temporarily. And we'll come back up here and we'll just plop it down right there so we can just continue on with our research. Perfect. So now we can continue on with that, and that'll keep making them. So we can at least just get a move on with our researching. So that's been a good episode so far. I know it hasn't been too much of progress. We're kind of slow starting because we're planning everything out very carefully and all that kind of good stuff. So it looks like, I don't know, it seems like iron is just something we need to boost up production on since now we have all these because it's not even making it to the end. But we'll see. We'll see how it goes once we boost up more. So next time we'll try and work on getting Science Pack 2s made already. And Science Pack 2s are inserters and transport belts. Transport belts are iron plates and iron gear wheels. So the transport belts will probably go around here. And these will come and split off. And then we'll make them down here. And it'll go down this way. And eventually we're going to run into our coal area down here since we leave too much space but that's fine we can easily just move the coal power plant we can move it over there somewhere out of the way somewhere simple and then we can come up here and work on some inserters because inserters use electronic circuits and iron gear wheels so we can take the iron gear wheel and iron that's making transport belts and we'll actually just add on the extra one in order to make inserters so we'll actually take some electronic circuits from here We'll make them come straight down this way. Or maybe we'll make them go through the middle or something. Some kind of magic. We'll make them come down here and split off and all that kind of good stuff. I think we did make it to spread out. I think I did. Because this middle area here is going to give me issues. But that's okay. It'll just leave a gap and maybe this side can be for steel production or something like that. Ah, we'll figure it out as time goes on. It'll all be fine. That's the that's the part fun part of playing Factorio is you can just change things as you want and redo them and make them better. So let me know what you thought about it this episode. Maybe some things that I could do differently or different things I could put in different places or maybe some better strategies on how to go with it. And with that being said, I'll see you guys on the next episode.